<laughs> One more. I don't know why I did that instead of whatever. It doesn't matter. I don't like it when they don't give me a uh, number. Mostly because I kind of don't. I typically don't keep track of when or where my thing was before they hit me. One can only hope that I level up during this quest again so I get a refill on health without having to use a potion or anything. Because leveling up will, uh... Leveling up will restock your health and mana, but if... Bevox. I don't even know what to classify this thing as. Or Bovox. Like an ox of some variety, I think, but I'm not exactly sure. I don't know what the second part of it would be. So, Ravana, don't you think there's a less violent way we could accomplish this goal? Rather than knocking them out, couldn't we just, like, I don't know, give it to them? Ouch. Alright, I can make it. This thing will be dead. And I will level up. Ow. I'm gonna stun him first, though. Alright. Bam. Bam. Alright. Level 8. 20 health, 5 mana, 5 stat points. It's all beautiful. Oh, throw. I don't really know if throw does that much more than like your regular hit, but I like it. Like 15, and if you put, yeah, I guess if you put it together with like the, uh, it does about as much as your two regular strikes put together, I believe. But I just like it. Throwing knife, it's cool. Just adds a bit of a neat flavor animation to it. Resist the immobility effect? Are you serious? I hate it when that happens. Oh yeah, sometimes they'll resist the immobility, but they'll still get hit by the dot. Which is nice. I forgot to go full screen again after that. Whatever. I'm going to be super inconsistent with that, let me tell you. Alright, sorry about the abrupt stoppage right before I'm going to be done in a bit. <laughs> but, I... I just kind of checked the timer, and at the same time checked to make sure that the thing was still going right and as far as the uh, recording goes. And it was typically when I record with OBS and check the folder, it will show the like file date and all that, and then right next to it the file size will be one kilobyte until I finish the recording. I got thrown off because it gave me like a really big file size, like several more kilobytes than just one after, or, which typically it will do after I finish the recording, but it doesn't do that in the middle of it. I just kind of open it and glance at the folder that I put 
the game recordings in to make sure that the recording is going. So I got tripped out because it was not how it usually was. So I just wanted to check. I thought I, I thought I might have stopped recording at some point that I didn't mean to make it stop. That didn't happen though, so I just kind of stopped my uh, Audacity recording for no reason. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna give ourselves a couple mana potions here. We're down to like the last three things that we need to do. Three things that we need to fight. I probably should have stunned him. Basilisks are usually not the greatest of news. I associate them with like the stone breath or stone gaze in like Final Fantasy. I guess they I guess in Final Fantasy X you got stone breath from them, but they never used it. I think they only ever stone gazed you. At least the ones that were actually called basilisks. I think other ones might have eventually stone breathed you. I do not recall exactly. My character's in a bit of a hurt. Oh god, that's why he's in a hurt box. They're hitting for like 25. Oh, I'm stupid. <laughs> I, I had him use both of my mana potions, and I don't think I even had that much. I don't, I don't even have that much mana to offer yet. I'm also stupid because I didn't stun this guy. A few bites and scratches later, you have placed all the stolen gold onto the forest monsters. Now that you have accomplished that, go back. You have accomplished your backwards task. Go see Robin after the Black Dragon box. I'll do this other quest for her later. But right now. Alright, a deal is a deal. Yay. Wow, you did a great job. You have held up your end of the deal, so you may have the box. I can have it. Just like that? Yep, just like that. What did you expect? I don't know, for something so valuable. I was expecting a tougher fight. I was expecting maybe some boss to pop up and... Not so fast, peasant. Yeah, like that. Ah, oh, that's more like it. You. Ah, oh, Ravana. Thank you for keeping the Black Dragon box safe for me. I see you've met my new friend. That's wonderful. Now I could kill you at the same time! Dracath, didn't you learn anything from last time? Yes, I learned that you are a fool for letting me live. This time I'm prepared for both of you. What the? <laughs> I don't remember that guy. Alright, I will have my Black Dragon box. I do not remember this thing at all. Uh, it has less HP though, so we're going to attack it first. Hmm. Alright, this is not sustainable this way. I have to smoke myself there. Ow. I out. Please stop hitting me. I was gonna save stun for Dracoth once we got him 
dead. Who else we got? Crack him. Crack him. Alright, there we go. Robin a... Oh, almost. Also something that later in the game fixes as far as the usefulness of your uh, companions. They uh, rubber band to your level rather than Robina perpetually being at level 2. Oh, he resists the immobility. That's not good. That's not good at all. <laughs> oh, yikes. Alright, thankfully we have HP potions for this kind of thing. I still might not win. Oh, maybe not. I don't know. Ah, God. Alright, we're gonna heal again since we can't really do anything too spectacular. Anyway. Ouch. Throw. Mmm. All right. Wonderful. No! Impossible! You say that word a lot. You keep saying that word. I do not think it means what you think it means. Fine, I'll finish you fools later, but the box is mine. No, you can't let him open the box. What's in the box? It's empty. Empty? But how? Yes, empty. Give me my beautiful empty box. Already dumped the useless thing in box. Where did you dump it? It's an evil dump site, of course. To be continued. Complete quest. After opening the box and discovering that it was empty, the Sneevel confessed to dumping the contents at the Sneevel dump site. Maybe Twilly knows where that is. <laughs> oh man. Alright, well, we will do this quad force one some other time. Alright. First of all, the shout-out is spectacular. The Quad Force is a legendary object that, when assembled, will tele open the doorway to teleport a hero to defeat Gananana. <laughs> <laughs> the first piece can be found near... yeah, anyway. We'll find that some other time. But, this was fun to get started with. I'm going to enjoy going back through the beginnings of this game, because it's going to be fun to see how it shakes out in, you know, as it goes further along. Anyway, thank you for watching, and as always, follow me to Apex.